morning. Uh, welcome to the first lesson. I'm going to try to get y'all out of the... You can see my shadow, but I can. I'm not going to try to get into the camera. Uh, my main goal is to show you how to make the chord A. This is all open chords. I hope the shadow's not hurt anything. Okay. First of all, these three little dots that I've got in line, that's this finger here. That's the first finger, you know, number one. And what you're going to do is put it in your second fret. These are frets, each one of these. See how I've got this first fret where the matches are, second fret's where your finger goes. And uh, this is where it's going to look. Well, that, that's where you're going to look. Now, the top string, you're going to deaden it. Set X, that means to deaden it. The bottom string, you want to deaden it too. So we're, we're deadening, deadening the first and the sixth string, which is the bottom and top. And the way you do that, let me get up here a little closer. You see a stone right here? It's hard to do for me right here. See? Hear that thump? See? That's all you gotta do is lay your thumb on it just so it won't ring out. And then as you go down, I'm gonna, you go all the way down. And actually you're dead in it with this bottom of this finger right there. So you just that's the easiest chord that we're gonna see. It's the hardest one to see for me naking it because of all these fingers are in my way. Now, this is the correct way of doing it. Excuse me. See that right there? But I'm not going to give you all of that. That's later on. So, that's the chord A. Again, let's go over this again real quick. Let me get in the shadow in here. The first fret, you want to deaden. I mean, the top. Let me start that up. The bottom string, the top string, we're going to deaden it. The second fret. You're going to use that finger only and put it on the other strings. That would be the second, third, and fourth string. So if you, if you like, let me just make a little sketch of that, of this right here, and you can, you know, refer back to it. Or subscribe to my channel, and uh, you can always go back to the, you know, episode. Chord A. That's what I'm going to name this episode Chord A. Okay. Uh, I hope I didn't confuse y'all on this. Alright. Uh, I'm going to bring this up. Uh, I got a, This is a tip jar. Now, this is it's not mandatory, but you know, by all means, but if you feel that you, you know, throw a tip at me. On my PayPal, it's G-E-N-E-B-C-K at gmail.com. See it up here in purple? Yeah, like I say, everybody else asks for money, man, why not me, huh? <laughs> All right, that's Court A. Get this out of the way. Uh, tomorrow I'll be doing a Court B, and that's the way it's going to go, you know. Every time I make one of these videos, I just like one A, chord A, chord B, chord C, chord D, E, F, and G. And then we'll get into all these other things, sevenths, six, and I'll explain to you why you have to know those. But right now, we're just going to go with the open chords, and uh, that'll get you going. So, this is the chord A, you know, down here at the bottom. All right, well, good luck, and uh, hope this does justice. Next one, I'm going I'm to enlarge this, this right here where you can see it a little better. I don't know if y'all can see it real good or not. Uh, since this is the easiest card, I figured, you know, I'm just going to leave it like that for now. But next time, it'll be bigger. That way, you know, and brighter, you can see it a little better. <coughs> okay, I think that's about all. Uh, like I say, if you have any questions, you can always 
to subscribe to the channel and you can, you know, rewind it, you know, go back and look at it. So, uh, for those of y'all, for those of you that's not subscribed yet, you know, just subscribe and you can see it. You can always go back to this episode A or episode B or whatever you want to do and if you have any questions, you can always refer back to the videos. All right, well, I'm going to get out of the, court, uh, the shade here. All right, we all have a good day. I'll see y'all next time.